A young American dancer with that powerful message to the critics who said she'd never be a star. Now, making history. ABC's Mara Schiavacampo. Misty, take a bow. <laughs> A moment in history shared on Instagram. Dancer Misty Copeland celebrating with her fellow dancers after learning of her promotion, becoming the first African-American female principal in the American Ballet Theater's 75-year history, the highest honor for a performer. My dream has been ABT since I was 13, and um, to be a, a principal dancer is, is reaching those heights. Calling herself an unlikely ballerina, the 32-year-old didn't even begin dancing until she was 13, old for ballet, and was often told she was all wrong for it, as she shared with our David Muir. What did you hear? I'm black. We don't exist in the ballet world. Um, I'm too muscular. I'm too short. My bust is too big. One of six kids raised by a single mother, she gracefully leapt over countless obstacles, becoming one of the most famous ballerinas in the country, even inking a you sports apparel right endorsement feet. deal Achilles with Under Standard. Armour. A new kind of ballet star, now preparing for her next act. Mara Schiavocampo, ABC News, New York. Congratulations, and thank you for watching. I'm Amy Robach. I'll see you tomorrow for Good Morning America. For David and all of us here at ABC News, good night.